गुड इवनिंग गुड इवनिंग एंड गुड इवनिंग कैसे हैं आप लोग फर्स्ट ऑफ चांद रात मुबारक और एडवांस में ईद मुबारक दिल तो नहीं चाह रहे ईद मनाने का मगर क्या करें वट टू डू जस्ट डे वी हैड अ प्लेन क्रैश एंड टूडे वी आर हैविंग दिस काइंड ऑफ Eat the early Eid celebration. It's supposed to be done day after tomorrow, but uh, anyways, well, this is what life is. So we have to get along with it. Uh, just final uh, conclusion about nineteen eighty six. Actually, yeah, I am having this high sore. So please forgive, forgive me for that. But since yesterday, I am having this pain in the eye. So. and i'm doing the testing of d6 in this kind of condition because uh, i supposed to run this machine today but uh, i was fortunate enough to get one more day so tomorrow let's i'm going to return it um and since last 2 3 days i gone through the basis of this machine extensively and i well i was coming back today after testing this machine into the field um and i was uh, i knew that i have to go live again in order to share with you kind of a final thoughts of mine about nike and d6 um and i can tell you straight away that usually people were expecting that the next iteration should be d5s right uh shouldn't be uh it shouldn't be d6 but here is the thing when you were having d3 d3s then you have d4 d4s so the significant jump between d3s and d4 was a lot of things was changed megapixel were increased high so performance dynamic range stuff like that but when you when next from from d4 to d4s there was not that a significant increase me for example the megapixel was the same yeah we had the increase in the iso that's it right so why why would why don't we have the same thing for d6 uh, megapixel is the same iso is the same then why it's not called d6 or oh, why it's not called d5s why it's called d6 and here's the thing i i own and use d3 d3s d4 d4s at various point of time so i use them all and i can tell you i do i i i never owned d5 but i used d5 i i based on my experience whatever i had brief i am not a pro photographer but i i i i use this this machine extensively a lot for my personal use so my experience is based on that and i can tell you right now that d6 is the name d6 based on his superior autofocus system i shot thousands of frames approximately 6000 frames in last 3 days and in those 6000 frames i was 99% of the time or 98 99 or 98% of the time i was on 3 3d tracking continuous auto focus which in canon terms called uh, servo so i was continuously on servo or continuous auto focus and i was on constantly 3d tracking that's it i i was not using single point auto focus i was not using group auto focus i was just using 3d tracking why because the 3d tracking the moment i start using 3d tracking i realized that that feature it's so killing that it make you not using any other option like group auto focus or uh, all 105 auto focus points the 3d tracking 
and if even if I'm losing the, the focus, if I'm shooting a bird and I'm losing the focus, I just release the auto focus button. I press it again. It quickly hunts for the moving subject, acquires the focus, and start tracking. So this machine it's so intelligent in multiple ways if you are missing focus it's your fault this is spot on don't take it personally but this is the way this machine is i don't have high speed focus lenses like 400 2.8 e type 500 f4 fl or 600 f4 fl those lenses are blazingly fast and if you use those lenses with D6, trust me, the combination is going to be so killing that you will start going to bite your nails. I mean, seriously. Because I was using uh, 200 to 500, 5.6, which is an average lens. It's sharp, but it's an average lens. And that lens was performing so fast which I never had this kind of fast also focus response from that average lens before that. But with D6, that was way too fast. Way. So, even today I spent like 2 hours shooting birds and uh, shot like 1500 frames. 15, yeah, 1500 frames. And I was all the time on 3D tracking. So, when it, uh, I already made a video uh, with my, with the examples that I took for uh, in compared to D4S, the color accuracy, the white balance accuracy, and the higher ISO performance of D6 is surpassing D4S. I don't have D5, but it surpassing D4S so for sure. If not 100%, then 50% it goes more than D5. That's what this new machine every single time is all about. So, I am, I never impressed. How we all know how the Nikon autofocus works. It's never like Canon. Canon dual auto, uh, dual pixel autofocus is world class. But now, I can assure you that with this is out of focus, 1DX Mark III going to have tough time. It never had before, but now it's really going to have tough time. See, maybe you think that somebody is paying me to talk about D6. Nobody is paying me anything. I am just sharing with you my honest, honest opinion coming from my heart, coming from my experience brief experience whatever you say but it's it is true i am not making any money if i'm recommending you anything i'm just saying what what is best when it comes to night and when it comes to d6 that's the best dslr right now in the market with superior autofocus system in any near nikon dslr history so it's going to be expensive but it's worth every penny 100% D6 it's all about autofocus that's it I mean you are not don't think about high ISO performance D5 is says the same but in D6 you are having an improved dynamic range improved voice performance when it comes to shadow recovery much better than d5 especially at low isos so d5 was suffering but d6 is or is surpassing that level so i don't know what what to say more but i really want somebody to buy my d4s so i can go for d6 because i really love this machine it's tough like a brick it's literally like a brick and uh, oops d6 is basically uh, the next level stuff that you should go for 
इफ यू आर एक्शन स्पोर्ट्स फोटो जर्नलिस्ट वाइल्ड लाइफ फोटोग्राफर दिस इज़ द मस्ट मशीन आई कैन अश्योर यू यू वॉन्ट रिग्रेट सिंगल एनी इफ यू वट एवर यू गोइंग टू इन्वेस्ट ऑन दिस मशीन बिकॉज वन शिट सी दिस इज अ थिंग आई वॉज वन ऑफ द फर्स्ट गाइज हु वॉज कर्सिंग बी सिक्स वेन इट वॉज अनाउंसड विद द सेम स्पेक्स लाइक बी फाइव ओनली वट दे वर टॉकिंग अबाउट सुपीरियर आउट फोकस दैट्स एट देर वॉज नथिंग मेजर एंड आई वॉज लाइक मैन इट्स गोइंग टू बी अनदर डी फाइव बट द मोमेंट आई कॉट दिस कैमरा एंड आई स्टार्ट यूजिंग एंड द मोमेंट आई स्टार्ट यूजिंग थ्री डी ट्रैकिंग आई लिटरली सोल्ड आई एम नॉट किडिंग आई वॉज द फर्स्ट गाय हु वॉज कर्सिंग दी सिक्स आई जस्ट सेट दैट बट आफ्टर यूजिंग दी सिक्स आउट ऑफ फोकस सिस्टम मैन दिस द बेस्ट आउट ऑफ फोकस that have i ever experience in any nikon camera i'm not kidding i use them all i own them all at various various point of time b6 auto focus is the best in the class you give this camera the best lens auto focus like 600 f4 fl 500 f4 fl 182 400 f4 el or 70 to 200 fl you give this lens the best class and i can assure you thing you never going to miss the focus 100% nearly 100% and even if you are going to miss the focus is going to be your fault you don't know how to lock the focus at the first place because this machine as it's not going to forgive whatever comes it will lock and it will track i have done it i have tested this and whenever if i am missing something it's my fault because i was not able to acquire the focus in the first place once you acquire the focus leave this leave that to this machine now rest is your expertise how you are planning the shot how you are engaging the auto focus it's on you it's not on the machine fault so oh man i am sold for d6 i never said anything about d5 because for me d5 was just another camera but d6 the more i am using the more i am falling in love with this camera auto focus system it's superior the best in the class the best of the best of the best sir with honors i am not kidding this is exactly what this machine is all about um so that's it guys i thought to share with you my input because tomorrow this baby is going back to nikon um and i'm going to miss it i will be keep uploading the sample images i just upload today the eid mubarak images i image which i took from the d6 with a slow lens it, but i was able to acquire focus and the rest the camera was able to track the birds so it was an easy job for me thank you very much and i'll see you guys soon